Hey guys, it's Bethany with ABQ Creations here with another tutorial for you. Today I'm going to show you how to add the stitching onto your footballs for our football headband. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Please be sure to check out my channel for all my other pattern tutorials and stitch tutorials. And be sure to hit that subscribe button and press the bell icon so you can stay up to date on all of my current projects and tutorials. I'm going to jump right into the tutorial and show you how to add those stitches onto those footballs. If you have any questions or comments for me, please leave them down below in the comments section. Okay, so I've already went through and stitched on my three 18 millimeter buttons. I went ahead and just cut off one long string of um, one long piece of yarn from my green. And then I just started with my first one and then I strung it through and then I was able to stitch on the second and then strung it through again and stitched on my third. That way I only had my front end to weave in and the back end to weave in. It just saves a little bit of time. Just thought I'd recommend that. Just make sure if you do that you don't pull too tight so it cinches up here and you should be fine. And I'm going to do the same concept with my stitching. You can see I already did one of my little footballs. So this is what we're going to do on the rest of them. If you think that's a bit much, you can always do every other football. So it's like every other one is showing the laces. And I also recommend using kind of a thinner yarn if you can find it. This is um, from a baby yarn collection. So I felt like that would work rather well for this. I wanted to keep the same look of yarn, so I didn't want to switch over to thread. But it's all up to personal preference. And then on the back, you can see where the stitching is just showing. But that's okay. I'm going to just kind of run this through the back. Again, I'm using one long piece, so I will just have to weave in at the front here. And then hopefully at the back. And I left myself a pretty good length. All right, so now to get started, I like to start with the top, and then I come down the center, and then I work the bottom, and you can go right to left or left to right, it doesn't really matter. And then I like to do the center one, and then I like to place the last two. That way I can kind of keep it just a little bit on center. So I start here, then I come down, then I do this, and then I do the center, and then I will do those two, and then we can string it on down. And when you're going through, because your leaf kind of bunches up, make sure you're not going through here to get into the brown. You don't want to cut through your green. When coming up, I like to go through the thread or through the yarn just to kind of secure it in place. And there you have it folks, this is my football cheerleading headband. Thanks so much for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Let me know in the comment section down below. If you have something else you'd like to see, let me know and please give this video a thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments for me, please leave them in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching guys, have a wonderful day, and remember, Go Pack Go!